Hey everybody, welcome to my new girls. Come on, viewers and followers, welcome to tuning in. If you guys want to see a review on Allocate Naturals, please stay tuned. All right, y'all. So this is a review on the Allocate Naturals. Um, before we get started, I just want you guys to know that I do have the air conditioner on, so I apologize for the noise in the background. It is hot in here, so you're just going to hear the air conditioner at some point. You know, you're going to hear the air conditioner. But anyway, just listen to my voice or whatever the case is, okay? All right, so let's just get into it. Okay, so this is the Allocate Naturals Lemongrass Hold It Styling Gel. Contains quality ingredients for kinky, curly, wavy, straight locks, okay? And I'm going to do a brief synopsis on this, and um, I'm going to try to probably put a demo. Um, if not, um, you can go to my video video it's very it's long but um, you'll just see me use the product there um, but I'm gonna show you what it looks like and then um, and let you guys know everything whatever the case is but I know you guys want to see a demo but um, you can go to that video and you can see the demo there okay so I'll put it in the i card above or I'll put it down in the description bar below okay or I'll try to put a clip in here I'll see but um, I probably erased <laughs> that on my computer so yeah all right so here we go all right so this is the allocate naturals lemongrass hold it styling gel contains quality ingredients for kinky curly wavy straight locks so this is eight ounces okay i'll go close in a minute after i'm finished all right so it says give your curls the kind firm manageable definition you want with our new lemongrass hold it styling gel show off your favorite styles juicy curls defined twist out and sleek edges using products within the lemongrass style collection lemongrass oil helps to strengthen hair follicles promote healthy hair growth reduce hair shedding soothe dry hair and itchy scalp make hair feel silky and look shiny okay and the ceo and the co-founder is rochelle graham campbell a hair tip before applying new gel to second or third day hairstyles spray hair with water until damp to re sorry to reactivate existing gel add a small amount of gel and style as desired disclaimer these statements have not been evaluated by the food and drug administration this product is not intended to diagnose treat cure or prevent any disease this product is not food do not consume for external use only directions after washing hair apply a generous amount of styling gel and distribute from roots to ends style is desired using heat or allowing the hair sorry allowing to air dry for second day curls spray hair with water until damp and apply gel scrunch and redefine curls into desired style ingredients water glycerin um has jojoba jojoba uh, seed oil and there's some other ingredients okay there's no mineral oil petrolatum or silicones I will put the ingredients in the description bar below I'll, or I will have it in the video somewhere so you guys can see because I know a lot of y'all like to see the ingredients so I will put it there okay all right so I'm gonna see if there's anything else okay go to allocatenaturals.com this is made in the use sorry USA this is black onyx world okay and this is a black own company and she has been on YouTube for a very long time and I believe I met her at the hair show a while ago and she um, is on YouTube she still makes YouTube videos um, but prior to making her product she was on YouTube for a long time and I just basically seen her you know blow up okay so yes all right so this is what the packaging looked like we're gonna go up close all right this is what the packaging looks like okay as you guys can see is um it looks very nice and elegant as you guys can see here and um, we're going to look at the consistency of it it is a gel um it's very it's, it's clear you guys can't see it so we're just going to take some out so you guys can see the consistency and what it looks like so let's go here all right this is what it looks like okay very stiff okay all right and it doesn't smell like anything it has no smell no smell at all so to those of you that are probably um you know have a high sensitivity you know high sensitive you know high sensitive uh put some right here okay so let me back it on up to those of you that have a you know um you know have bad allergies like me or you know just sneeze at anything that's too perfuming and stuff like that this will be a great product because it has no smell at all um, so let's get into um, the the whole you know shebang bang okay so I know a lot of people want to know does it flake up okay um, I didn't see any flakes um, 
it it does get your hair hard okay it doesn't leave any white residue but the only thing is is that when you twist the hair and then you apply the clip when you take the clip off you see like the indentation of the clip so it probably appears or looks like there is some residue or something but it's just like the shininess or whatever from where the clip was so that's the only thing so as far as residue i think i saw probably one little flake somewhere but not really a od like it didn't flake up to where my hair you know like i was snowing everywhere nothing like that but um it depends on how much you use okay you want to really use a dime size and you want to make sure that you don't over excessively use it unless you're doing some other type of style i can only speak for um locked people or, or for people that are locked i'm sorry i can only speak for myself i have locks you know so um as far as like scrunching and doing all that that doesn't apply to me so um so what i could say for if you want to apply more because it says to spray the hair and then apply more you guys know i always say for me for my locks is that i never apply pro apply, apply product apply the gel i always spray or whatever the case is so if i have to retwist i'll probably spray with the lemongrass spray that they have and then i'll probably just retwist that retwist it to activate the gel and then i'll put the clips in that it. I'm not going to add any additional product or well, any additional gel. I'll spray the spray just to refresh my hair. And if I want to, you know, keep it up or retwist it, I'll do it that way. But I'm not going to reapply any more gel because I don't want it to flake up and I don't want to have that build up or whatever the case is. Um, there is a hold. Um, the hold is, is hard. Um, but after a while, it does loosen up. So it doesn't stay hard the whole time. Um, I have used it and this is probably like the second week, I believe. So this is the second week of it. So my hair and, um, the reason why I was like this, because <laughs> I really don't tie my hair at night. Um, you know, I'm going to be honest. I told y'all that I really don't tie my hair. Um, some nights I do and sometimes I don't. So that could be because of me. And so, yeah, but, um, it's still, you know, still, you still see the parts and stuff like that. So it's still like held up. But as far as, um, you know, as far as it being hard, it's not hard anymore. Um, it's, it's a soft hole now, so it doesn't stay hard for a long time. Um, you're probably going to ask me, did I um, blow, I'm not blow dry, I go into the dryer? No, I did air dry. I like to air dry my hair because, number one, I'm rushing, okay, so I don't have time to sit under a dryer. Um, I don't have a hooded dryer. I do have, like, one of those bonnet dryers, so I would go under there. Probably the next time I use it, I'll do that to see if there's a difference, but I always air dry, and that's just basically about that. I don't really do the bonnet or the hooded dryer because number one my hooded dryer broke okay i don't have one anymore but i have the bonnet so um sometimes like i said nine times ten i'm rushing why should i be rushing now i don't know but um you know before everything you know the pandemic and stuff like that um i've been rushing and so um you know I didn't have time to do all that. Okay, so that's basically about that. Yeah, so that's it. I like the packaging. Um, would I recommend this? Now, if you have the money, um, you know, buy it because she is on the pricey side. Okay, I forgot how much this was. I will annotate it in the video. Now, I purchased this because I wanted to try it, and plus, I wanted to do black owned, and I did purchase it from Target. You can purchase it from a website. Um, I believe she has good Black Friday sales, and she does have other sales as well. So so if you really want to try it, please check her sales. And if Target has some type of sale that you apply to this to push it down, definitely get it. Um, this is at CVS as well. I believe it's at Walgreens, but I know it's at CVS. So if you have the extra bucks, you know how you get the extra bucks from CVS, then use that to get it because um, this can run pricey. You know, especially if you, you know, want to make this your holy grail product in your hair regimen. Um, so I would suggest that you do use the dime size because um, using, um, you know, over the dime size, you can use this product pretty quickly, especially if you're doing a wash and go style, but I'm only talking for locks. So for a lot of people, um, you know, using a certain amount of you know um product like a dime size or whatever the case is this can last you for a while um it says 24 months when you open it so that's when it will expire so i mean you want to use it you know you want to frequently use it but not too much to where you'll be spending your money like every two to three weeks okay and it also depends upon how often you are retwisting your hair so when i wash my hair i wash my hair every three to four weeks so this will last me i will not have to purchase this 
probably in another eight or nine months or 10 months or whatever the case is because I don't use a lot of product. I don't, so the little product that I use didn't make it, you know, didn't make it hard. So it was like, you know, don't OD because you're probably going to end up with some type of residue and your hair is going to be extra hard. I only apply it to my roots. I do not do the palm rolling, not at this moment. Um, but I just, you know, don't ask me. I don't even know why I don't, I just, cause I, I don't have time. Okay, so I just do the roots and I'm done. Okay, um, so that's basically about that. I'm on a thick consistency scale. Um, it's a, on a 10. Um, we're not dancing with it. It's very sturdy or whatever the case is. It's a gel. Um, is it in my price range? I mean, at the moment when I purchased it, it was. But as far as purchasing all the time, um, I definitely will get an alternate, something that is in my, you know, my price range. Um, but purchasing this all the time. But like I said before, I wanted to support, you know, black-owned companies. So I definitely supported her. And um, so I will say at the time, it was in my price range. Um, I will recommend this product if you are looking for some type of gel or whatever the case is. I'm, you know, speaking for a locked hair, um, naturals. Um, so you could definitely use this and also loose naturals if you want to try it as well. Um, I know she has, um, some products that are solely towards locks. I was going to purchase something from her lock line, but it was sold out on her website. So I'm going to check again after, um, you know, now and see if it's available and then I'll probably, you know, buy it. I shall see, but they didn't have it at Target and they didn't have it at CVS, but I was able to purchase this. This was at, um, Target. Um, so what else I want to say? Yeah. So was it my purchase? I will give this about four and a half stars, um, because of the way it felt a little bit sticky. I got like the stickiness on my hands. So, and it felt like it probably was going to leave some type of residue. So I was kind of scared. So yeah. So, but it didn't, it didn't leave, you know, it, my hair was pretty good after a while. So I was like, you know what? It's cool. Maybe it's the, it's the way it goes on your hand or maybe, you know, the type of oils I already had on my hand or something like that. You know, I don't know. You just never know. So I was scared with that. So just, just that feeling a little bit. I don't really don't like that. So that, that's the only thing. That's why it's four and a half. Um, the packaging is very nice, very elegant looking, and it does look expensive. Um, yeah, because it is. <laughs> so, but anyway, um, but there are products that cost way more than this. So, um, you know, and supporting a black owned business, um, you know, we shouldn't be acting like that anyway. But if you have it, you have it. If you don't, you don't. I'm not trying to, you know, force products down nobody's throat. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, look into your budget, see if you could get it. If not, that's cool. You know, there's other black businesses that, you know, um, do have products that are, you know, at a reasonable price. You know what I mean? But um, I decided to purchase this because I have used her other products in the past and I was happy with them. So, but I'm happy with this as well. So here we go. Um, Allocate Naturals has done it again. Okay. Um, you guys know I have um, tried her, I think her mask. I tried her aloe berry gel, um, the lemongrass spray. I've tried the um the sage honey sage i think um conditioner i think that's what it's called and i think that's it i don't think i tried she had a butter she got a butter i forgot what it was called Ugh. but yeah I, I pretty much tried you know her um and i think i tried her oil her growth oil as well um but uh yeah so i, tr I try a good amount of products from her line so i don't want to keep this um line <laughs> sorry this um video too long i go on and on and on i don't want to okay but um i hope you guys enjoyed this review um if you um if i didn't put the vi uh the video within a video i'm um, definitely go check out how i do apply it onto my locks it's a lock um talking twist so if you guys want to sit down and talk with me you can and um you know i, I know a lot of y'all don't like long videos but if you just want to go and mute it or whatever you want to do and to see how I apply it on my locks you go ahead and do that so I may just you know send you over to that video to see the demo this is just a review so sorry about that y'all but that's just basically about that y'all all right I am done I hope I didn't leave anything out if I did I'll definitely annotate it in the video if you guys have any questions come on peace bye